there's a lot of dimensions I focus on. Like there's this uh, there's this word going around gent. It's become a, a, a genre, but really it started out just as being this this chord, which is a, a four note power chord. Now you could do this in standard if uh, you played zero two two four, I believe. But since I'm in drop, it would be zero 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 two. And you just get this metallic attack out of it, rather than sort of... I also don't use quite as much gain as you would think, because I really like to just dig in, and I like pickups that, that will be dynamic like that, where you can really get a certain sound by digging in that, that extra little bit. So, I want it to sound metallic like that, but I also have this other dimension I look for, I call it purr, where the note has to really it's like bloom and, and you hear this musicality, almost like there is more to the chord than what you're playing. I'm really just playing like power chords, two power chords there, right? But I want it to almost sound like it's a major chord and if you have a good, a good sounding amp, um, it'll ha naturally have these extra sort of harmonics in there. Where you place your hand on the bridge will sort of choke it up more or less. So you have to kind of find, depending on the guitar and your playing style and how you hold your pick, for that perfect point. Like, you know when you hear it. You can almost hear that as a major chord. So I like those, and I like that, that sort of aspect to the sound. And depending on the part, I will sort of move my hand back and forth uh, to whatever is appropriate if I need a tighter riff or more. Uh, a riff that has a little more attack I'll for more of that, but if I want it to sound musical and big, but it's still funky, and all that, and how to strike the strings, you know, strike them fast, but hard. And I also use, for this tour I've actually, like, used something completely different, because I've always liked jazz-shaped picks, but um, for this tour I've just been experimenting with this is a Planet Waves um, it's 0.46 millimeters very very thin I mean you look at that right uh, and I was having a lot of problems with tuning uh, maintaining my tuning and with strings going sharp you know I don't play with the thickest strings in the world and I do tune a little bit low so what you have it, what you have happen is um, the string would go sharp and then settle into tune it makes it very difficult to to tune it even on a tuner because it's like it's guesswork but um, with this, I've noticed that because the pick gives way instead of, you know, something like a jazz pick, which is very thick, the string gives way. Not only am I not snapping 68s on my low A flats anymore, but the, the notes aren't going sharp, which when you have three guitarists, if one guitar is out, you know, it sounds terrible. Uh, so tuning issues are even more important for us. But the, the chords will work even better because none of the notes are, are being sent sharp even for a split second. Um, it does make lead playing a little bit harder, but it's worth it. Um, so I'm experimenting with this for right now, and I've, I've been digging it for this tour. And I think that that's also a big part of, of the sound and, and it, the way that I attack the strings.